Hi friends, in this video we will learn about uh, some of the interview questions they will be asked related to payment gateway. First question is we will try to understand what is payment gateway. The payment gateway is nothing but it is a software phase or a software services. Its main purpose is it is allowing the merchants or shop owners to process the transaction. The transaction can be made through credit cards, debit cards or UPI payment, BM API or Paytm or any other form of payments online in a more secured way. So in order to make the payment very robust, secured, so we will be using the payment gateway. This payment gateway acts as a secure channel or it's access a mediator for transmitting the sensitive financial data. Here yeah, sensitive financial data could be your credit card information, your CVV number or your bank details or your PAN details or your other details. Everything will be transmitting in a very sensitive way so that your information will be very secure. We will try to understand how this payment gateway interface will work. When a customer places an order, let's say Amazon or Flipkart, anybody wants to buy certain things, they will go to Amazon and they will try to order the things and they try to make a payment. Whenever they try to make a payment in Amazon or a Flipkart, they try to enter the credit card details, CVV information, all those details which is very much mandatory to make a payment. That information will get transit online because after I enter the credit card details, it has to go to the customer bank for verifying whatever the information which I entered in the credit card details plus what is the balance in the account everything it will get validated and if everything is fine then it will try to process the overall uh, that uh, order otherwise it will decline the order that bank account as a sufficient balance and whatever the information we have provided everything is proper then uh, that payment gateway sends back to the merchant's website uh, everything is fine and uh, they are able to pay back for this order so that uh, they will transfer the funds from the customer bank to the merchant account and also by using this payment gateway it also provides a fraud detection or a fraud protection mechanism and other security measures also so that uh, we can completely rely on the online transaction that is the beauty of this payment gateway software. Now we will try to understand. So what are the different types of uh, payment gateways we have in the IT industry or a software world. The first type of payment gateway is redirect payment gateways. So basically here yeah, the payment gateways redirects the customer to the secured payment hosted by payment gateway provider to enter the payment information. And the second one is hosted payment gateway. The hosted payment gateway is this payment gateway display secured information on the merchant's websites itself like Amazon. So in Amazon itself, they will take you the form where we can enter all the information. Once the, all the information is entered and it directly goes to the payment gateway provider for processing. The third one is integrated payment gateways. The integrated payment gateways here the payment gateways allows merchants, merchants here Amazon or Flipkart can integrate uh, this payment gateway directly into their website. The way Amazon currently is working, we can enter all the information there itself without opening any new page. Fourth type of uh, gateway is mobile payment gateway. These payment gateways are specifically designed for mobile users such as smartphones or tablets and they use a different technologies such as near field communication or QR codes to facilitate the online financial transaction. Fifth type of payment gateway is point of sale payment gateway. This type of payment gateway we normally observe in the shopping malls such as DMART, Food World and all those places or retail stores 
or even the restaurants there different type of payment gateways will be adopted here which is called as a point of sale systems by using those payment gateways which is point of sales they will get the financial transaction to be completed using that gate so these are the five types of uh, gateways we have available at this moment and the third important question is okay we understood what is all about payment gateway and what are the different types of payment gateways we have now we'll try to understand what are the benefits or what are the advantages of payment gateway if we use this payment gateway what are the benefits do we get the first benefit we normally get is convenience by using uh, any payment gateways it could be online or it could be offline the payment gateways really helps in providing convenience because here everything does via electronic way or online way the second benefit they get is security because all the credit card information all the bank information all the personal information data which is passed through these gateways are completely encrypted and the third one is because we are using these days payment gateways because of that we will have more sales for the merchant as well and the fourth one is improved cash flow because everything is getting transferred online here it improves merchants cash flow and the global reach because the payment gateways we can pay by sitting in India, we can pay anything in USA or any anything in UK as well. Across the world, by sitting in one place, by click of button, you can purchase anything from anywhere in the world. That is a benefit we get out of this payment gateway. And the compatibility is also another ordered advantage um, by using this payment gateway because especially I am sitting in India and I wanted to buy from USA. I need to shell out the currencies, different currencies in terms of dollars and so on. These payment gateways will take care of all these aspects, the payment types and currencies whenever we are trying to operate uh, or buy certain things using these uh, payment gateways. Then we will try to understand what are the risk of uh, using a payment gateway. Till now we try to understand what are the advantages of payment gateway now we'll try to understand what are the risks associated if you use this payment gateway the first risk is fraud payment gateways normally which are more vulnerable for frauds this can be result in the financial losses for both merchant and customer as well because these days anything can be hacked by using various technologies as the technologies improves even thieves they use different mechanism different technologies to break these payment gateways when they do so there are chances that the credit card information may get tapped and uh, that would lead to a lot of financial losses for both uh, a merchant as well as to the customer second uh, drawbacks or risk of using payment gateway is chargeback then the third type of drawbacks is payment gateway downtime sometimes this is rarely occurred then the fourth risk they do see is uh, integration issues as well next type of disadvantage is payment uh, pieces because the payment gateways uh, normally charges uh, certain service charges and we have to keep in mind as well whenever we're trying to integrate payment gateway for your website or your shop then you should include all these pieces into consideration while using this payment gateway and the next one is security breaches as we discussed earlier there is a chances that it may get hacked or it may break the this payment gateway so that they can uh, capture the sensitive information 
that is also very crucial if it is not tested properly and the sixth important risk is compliance issues because each country will have different laws and regulation unless if you are not using properly then they will put lot of fines and legal consequences as well i hope you guys got a clear idea now what is all about payment gateway what are the different types of payment gateways what are the its advantages and what are its disadvantages Thanks for watching this video. Bye for now. Take care.